hi guys welcome back to my channel in today's video i'm going to be making tuba lift i'm using ankara for this tutorial you can use stretch material this video is a requested one a subscriber has requested for this video for the past maybe three weeks now or two i'm sorry about that for taking too long i fold into four and i measure from here place my tape here measure five inches i measure five inches and five inches i have two pieces and i do the same here i fold into two and i fold again i measure four inches four inches and four inches and i'm going to sew here i'm going to sew lines here four to five six lines i'm going to sew here measurement here is 20 inches by 25 inches and i have this one 18 inches by 25 inches and i fold into two because very thin very thin here so i want to get quarter inch which after folding into two i have quarter inch here after folding into two i place on top i bring the material this way After folding this into two, I have nine inches. It's 18 inches. After folding into two, I have nine inches. Just for me to get the thickness, that is why I fold it into two. So after folding into two, I have quarter inch here. It's just like a foam. You can use this to make pillow. This, then I fold this way. I will sew up to five lines or six lines here. And this one I will place on top. This is the right side, this is the wrong side. I will place it on top the wrong side like this. And I will place the wrong side to cover. So this is the wrong side. I will also place it on top like this. And I will sew gently, very close to the foam. I will sew very close to the foam. So when I'm done doing that, I will show you. I have this beautiful bag. I will leave the link in the description box. You can go and check it out. You click on it and you can watch it from there. This beautiful simple bag and I have so many other videos you can benefit from I'm done sewing I hope you can see the lines I hope you can see the lines I have six lines here and I'm also done with the top. And what I will do now is to bring it this way. I use 23 inches. Sometimes I use 22 inches, depends on the material. Sometimes I use 23, 23 inches or 22 and a half inches. I'm going to be using 23 inches. 23 inches after folding into two will give me 11 and a half inches, which is here. I will sew here. I'm going to sew here now. After doing that, I will sew this on top. I'm done sewing. I notch here 
here and this is where I sew. If you don't want yours to be high like this, you can measure eight inches, eight and a half inches. This one is nine and a half inches. So I will use half inch to sew. It will remain nine inches here. So this one, I also notch one, two, three, four. I will place where I notch together like this and sew round. I will place this way. I will sew here. Getting here, I will bring it this way. I will sew it round. When I'm done sewing, I will show you the final look. I'm done sewing. The back I will make just one or two plates on the back. On the back I will sew here just one or two plates on the back. I try to sew with my sewing machine. My machine could not handle the thickness so I will sew with thread and needle on the back. This is the first one. I will bring the second one and I will sew. After that, I will show you how it looks. After I finish sewing, I tie on the back and cut. This is how to sew tuba lift. Very simple to sew. Like I said, you can use stretch material for it. I use Africa prints. This is the final look, guys. If you like this video please give it a thumbs up if you are new you are welcome please subscribe and remember the notification bell please share this video to friends and loved ones thank you so much for watching and i will see you all in my next video if you want yours to come down you can use seven or eight inches but if you want this size nine inches this is the finished look